Hello dear friends, thank you for watching. Uh, this is Mikomai. Uh, tonight I'm so pleased to introduce my one of my oldest uh, performance painting. I created 2014, the beginning of my artist career. Uh, this is this is the one. This is called Once Again. It's a very much charismatic and tragic and uh, very theatrical story and uh, tonight I love to talk about story at the same time how I created or what what's the inside so let's um, experience and discover this uh, performance painting together let's say. but this theme is about true love and uh, like this, like I said, this uh, was a uh, very beginning of my career as an artist. So um, I didn't think about it at all. It's uh, a completely pure uh, meditation that time. Um, uh, I created in the middle of uh, uh, the picture. I create. I started creating in the middle. And then I thought maybe there's a you know story behind uh, this uh, mid uh, painting. Well, so like I said, uh, I was too young to think uh, why I'm creating because for me art was like myself. I art equal is me. Uh, ever, um, Things I can live, uh, I can't even remember when did I became an artist. I think I, I was an um, artist before I was born, so my previous art, my, uh, life must be an artist too. So um, I didn't think about it. Why did I create it? Uh, this is mystery. Um, because I want it. Well, we have a chapter one and a chapter two and a chapter three. It's This is a very theatrical and a charismatic story. It seems like tragic, but in the end, a very really happy story, so I hope you like it. And uh, let's begin. Once upon a time, there's a beautiful prince and beautiful princess. But uh, there wasn't the same creature, so prince was human like us. He's 15 years old, he can do anything, like he's very handsome, he's good at study, he's good at the martial arts. People loved him, and uh, he was crown prince. So, king, uh, he his uh, wife passed away a long time ago when he was little, but he loved him very much, and the people loved him. And then he loved people. He loved his father, respected his father very much, and then his life was pretty much perfect. It sounds like pretty perfect, but uh, it changed one night and uh, another uh, character she's a princess she's an um, elf so she's living under the uh, so she has only she doesn't have sun in the, he, her country did not have sun she had only magical moon a uh, magical moon um, will you know makes yourself uh, herself her family her people much younger so they for example she's actually like thousand years old but she look like 15 and then she never get old she just get powerful every single day that's all and then she's also crown princess that she's most beautiful smartest and then people love to her and she go at martial arts so this too was very perfect um, once upon a time the prince, he's always into night, especially looking at the moon. And today was tonight was very special. Um, he always interests a uh, full moon or a new moon, but it's, this time was not even a uh, full moon or new moon. It seems like a very simple, but if it so attracted him, so he decided to walk. He always loved to walk in the night time. 
especially in the black forest. It's called black forest. Um, and then he knows how to get there. He knows the road. He he come there. He go there like thousand times. So he knows. But tonight he found something very curious. Curious turtle. He never see. It's very small. But at the same time, he saw I could go inside and then discover what's inside. So he went to inside, and then after the tunnel, he stand totally different world, like beautiful uh, stars, a beautiful moon, huge magical moon, and then he was just amazed by how beautiful the view and. The, Building was absolutely different. Of course, it's an elf building. It's totally different, and uh, he was uh, amazed by how beautiful it is. And uh, he was walking, and then he met princess. Her name is Rera. He met her, and then when he saw her, he fell in love instantly. And then he proposed her. S soon after, he saw his uh, her eyes. And then uh, he proposed her, and uh, he said, I'm Prince of blah, 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 I love you, or I'd love to marry you, or something like that. And then she saw, she was quite uh, interested in him, but at the same time, she knew, she noticed he's not elf, he's a human. So she told him directly, um, you are human, you are not supposed to come here. And the prince leave at once and never speak about this place. Never come back here. She said to him a little bit harshly, and then he went back home. But he would, he can't stop uh, thinking about that place. He stop thinking about her as well. So also next day he went back home. Uh, went back to see her, and then she said to no to him. And then another day too, he kept going back to see her and propose her. And then he spent like many days to do the same thing. And then people in his kingdom start, you know, talking about whispering and talking about him. He seems very odd. He seems very different than before. So of course he's in love, of course. And then his uh, father can worry about him because he's crown prince. So he asked one most trusted uh, servant to you know follow what he's doing. And then the servant found out he's meeting her. So king knows what he's doing. <laughs> Chapter two. Uh, prince. He's in danger, isn't he? Um, that night um, was full moon. We could say um, biggest moon, big moon. You could say that super moon in general. Uh, we could say um, he normally care about moon, but tonight, I mean these day, he's only interested princess. So he went to see her. And then uh, normally he noticed so many little things, but he focused about her only, so he, he didn't notice his father and his uh, and, uh, army, like thousands of army, was following him. He normally he noticed, but he didn't notice. So once again, he was proposing her. How amazing you are! I love you dearly. When can you get? I mean, when can I, can I, you know, marry you or something like that? And then the king saw he was proposing her. He, his head was like off. He can't think anything at all. Like he was so confused. My son maybe became a monster, or he's a. Uh, Possessed by a magical spell, or he's become not one of us anymore. Or like he starts thinking something like a totally different thing, and then his uh, final answer said to uh, his tired uh, 
team uh tire uh was well, so um army killed them my kill my son so in the painting it's showing the um the he's killing by his beloved army and he tried to reach her uh, because uh, he's he's surely loyal to her he surely uh, love her dearly and then at the same time she always refusing uh, his offer because she know that it will never work out but he always believed that we will marry sooner or later and then when he died she finally understood the true love she finally uh, felt that she really loved him dearly because she been refusing uh, uh, because uh, our race is different but uh, once he died she lost her mind she lost the senses she lost everything and then she found the dagger on the floor for some reason um, she stopped on her heart and then she killed herself so in this painting this um, beautiful true love couple died together same day and then the parents family people whole kingdom both of kingdom surrendered by sorrow sadness tragic when they died they became their soul became the light and the, the light made a circle and then when their parents passed away they joined the circle and then when the people who involved this matter they joined their lights when they uh, died and then they wait for perfect time perfect moment perfect day perfect place because uh, because this too has a huge influence to other people um, other people have a um, little scar I know surely our uh, main character has um, had a huge scar as well um, the scar of so they have a memory even they don't remember they hard to remember it remains well so they have to purify otherwise they can't keep moving so the, what they did they waited in the universe a perfect time all of them reverse again are uh, their same creature but they live in different country um, the same situation the beautiful prince handsome prince was a prince again beautiful lady beautiful uh, princess was princess again but they live in different country one day um, there has a um, like uh, uh, like a gathering from the other country other kingdom I would say um, they came with parents and uh, this two was walking at the garden with sun um, they was just uh, wondering how beautiful the weather, beautiful garden and then perfect moment came they met again and then they, when they look at each other some reason is so so um, you know warm and uh, something you, you felt before inside they don't know why but they fell in love and uh, he's holding the he grabbed a um, uh, flower from garden and then he wanted to give it to her but he was quite shy to give her this time he's slightly shy 
and then she was brushing and then I'm not sure. Uh, this is cool once again. So once again, they fell in love with Sun. And then the true love story began. Finally. And uh, they took the karmatic memory from the heart. And then they tried to uh, walk to the future. So this is showing the circle of life, like a previous life to life at the moment. At the same time, um, they can't make it same mistake again. So it's up to them, but I'm pretty sure they will marry and uh, live happily ever Um, surely, um, it's uh, very similar to my life. Um, uh, I create this one without thinking, without noticing myself. But after many years pass, um, when I think about it, um, it's very similar. And also, um, compared to 2014, I, my life did change a lot, uh, more simple and then more easy to understand myself um, because I did meditation, uh, mental health, uh, wellness, how I eat, how I sleep, how I meet people, how I talk, how I express my feeling, or how I create art piece, um, everything like combine each other and then surely um, everything uh, um, similar to this one. So it's kind of symbol of um, my past life, symbol of my life at the moment, uh, symbol of the, my future. So um, this is a very symbolic piece, symbolic, very, very theatrical, very dynamic. And uh, so, um, in the end, um, I understood that um, we need all. We all need love. We all need to support each other. We all need to have a good family, good friends, good collaborator, fellow friends. So I think um, life is uh, very simple. So therefore, we need to support each other, and um, this is this piece is about family and uh, true love, and about life itself. So very deep and spiritual work. So that's why it's very effective my life itself. So very something. I Thank you so much for watching. It was quite a long story, wasn't it? And uh, uh, I don't know if you liked it or not, but um, I had a good time anyway. And uh, see you next time. And uh, be happy and uh, yeah, enjoy your life. And uh, bye bye.